Hello everybody, it's Jordan Davis again. Thank you for clicking on this video and welcome back to my channel. As always, I do Eurovision reactions um, to Eurovision, of course, and Eurovision related content. So if you're ever looking for any of my videos and you're not on my page, you can just type in Jordan Davis Eurovision on YouTube and that should pull up all of my stuff. So before you ask, yes, I have a bandaid on my head because I was shaving my head today and I got reckless and I got too confident and then I cut myself pretty badly. Like it's not horrible, but it's worse than, you know, something you would just leave out in the open. So yeah, it's a bandaid. Don't, don't make fun of me for having a bandaid on my head. Shit happens sometimes, but Aside from that, I'm excited to continue with our bottom 10 week for Eurovision 2009. So, this week we are reacting to the bottom 10. Um, last week react we reacted to the top 10. And next week we're just going to react to some entries that um, are neither in the top 10 or the bottom 10 that you all have requested. So if you have any uh, countries that you want me to react to that aren't in the top or bottom 10, let me know. I think I have room for like two or three more still. So. We are reacting tonight to 35th place. So 35th place at Eurovision 2009 was Slovenia. Oh, Slovenia, y'all know I love y'all. I'm sad to see you so low, but hopefully this will still be good. Slovenia with the song Love Symphony by Fortissimo featuring Martina. So I don't know anything about this song. I've never heard this song, but I'm excited to get into it. Y'all know I love Slovenia at Eurovision. Um, and so I'm hoping this is another song that I can add to my list of Slovenian favorites, but we shall see. Um, the reactions I did last night made me a little afraid of what the rest of the bottom 10 would be like, especially um, Hungary's entry, but hopefully it will go up from there. So let's go ahead and see. So they really, they really took the symphony title literally with this, it looks like. We'll see if it stays that way. Y'all know I love a cello. So like, pop symphony, okay. I always wish I could play a stringed instrument. I can't. I can't play any instruments. That man, they just made that man carry that big old cello around <laughs> while everybody else has violins and violas. <laughs> Where's the singing? <laughs> Is there gonna be singing in this? Oh. Ask and you shall receive. So I know that they're not playing it live or like they're playing it, but we're not hearing what they're playing, but I wonder if they can actually play. Like, I wonder if they're the ones that recorded this, or if these are just some actors that they <laughs> that they found to play these. They were like, have to be big enough to carry a cello through the whole performance. <laughs> Okay, I love a breakdown. Love the wind. Give us some wind. Oh! This is, this is so dramatic, I actually like it a lot. Oh, 
Okay. Hit that note, Martina. Oh, sorry, that one ended quickly, <laughs> more quickly than I usually do. So actually, I am surprisingly pleased with that. I actually, I, I keep looking at myself, I look like a fool. Um, I actually liked that a lot more than I thought I would based off of last night's entries. But again, with the bottom 10, you never really know. Um, so admittedly, there was a lot more instrumental in this than there was vocal. And I think that was probably, I mean, clearly that was the point. Um, so I'd like to, if you know, let me know more about the song and why Slovenia decided to go that route. Um, for 2009 because it kind of reminds me of what I can't remember who did it someone in the 90s did like a similar thing not saying the songs are similar but just a similar like they just had a few vocal lines in there to make it follow the rules but otherwise it was really an instrumental track and this kind of reminded me of that again not in the song itself but just in that um, type of arrangement so that was interesting um, and I kind of wonder why they did that I liked it but I just wonder um, so I liked the melody of the strings, um, especially that do 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 um, and I appreciated that, that that motif kept coming back through to keep like regrounding the performance in something familiar. And I understand, I know the instruments are not, you know, amplified so that that's not what we're hearing. We're hearing the audio track, but I do still wonder if those were the people who recorded the instruments, if these people can even play the instruments or if these are just like dancers or actors that they found. I know it's a small thing, but whatever. So I actually enjoyed this. I enjoyed it more than, I'm gonna hold that thought for my recap video. So we won't say that. But anyway, I enjoyed this. I think this was a perfectly fine entry. I mean, I could see why it didn't qualify, but like, if it did somehow qualify, I could also see why if it were to have qualified and then end up like low. I could see that happening too. But anyway, let me know your thoughts. As always, like, comment below, because again, I love hearing your thoughts and that's really why I do this. And then please consider subscribing if you haven't already. I would love to have you with us. We are doing our kind of off week where we just do nine top or bottom 10 entries next week. And then we'll be on to 2010. So it's exciting times around here. So thank you for clicking on this video. Thank you for watching this video and I will see you next time.